The city of Edinburgh is saying goodbye to cigarettes in nearly all public places. Commissioners just voted to make Edinburgh the only city in Hidalgo County with a 100% smoke-free ordinance. CBS 4's Annalise Ortiz live from our Farm McAllen newsroom with more. Annalise. Marcy and Eddie, the city of Edinburgh used to have one of the most lenient smoking ordinances because you could smoke inside of restaurants. You could also smoke inside of bars the way you can in McAllen and other places. But as of tonight, Edinburgh becomes the strictest on smokers. All in favor signify by saying aye. 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 The Edinburgh City Council approved changes to their smoking ordinance Tuesday night. Smoking cigarettes is no longer allowed in bars, restaurants, pool halls, and other public places. A lot of families were going elsewhere to eat because of the smoke being so bad. It's a couple of the establishments we had. A public hearing was held two weeks ago in which several people urged the council to crack down on secondhand smoke, including seven-year-old Aliana Veloria. I was telling them about... Um, what's been happening about second smoking, what's been happening at restaurants. Her mother was a waitress and died last year. The family believes secondhand smoke may have contributed. Aliana and others are calling the council's decision a win. I'm just real happy they passed it. Although the ordinance takes effect immediately, the city will allow a grace period when it comes to enforcement, giving bar owners time to adjust. It'll be all right with, with a patio. I got a patio in the back, so that's where they'll probably smoke most of the time. Martinez isn't concerned that customers will opt for bars in other cities where they can smoke inside. The city council weighed the business impact and found they weren't concerned either. I'm pro business, small business, and I got phone calls, but nobody could come up with evidence or facts that they ever got affected. I mean, at the end of the day, like I said, there's more non-smokers than smokers. In fact, the council hopes to see a boost in business now that the air in nearly all establishments will be smoke-free. Places like cigar bars and hookah lounges will be exempt from this ordinance. Live in the Farm McAllen Newsroom, Annalise Ortiz, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.